and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create link in bio or a mini website using Canva. Yes, you can do that right in Canva. So let me show you how. I want to search for bio link website, which is what you have here. So it can give me the template available and I can have an idea of what I'm trying to create. So you can see there are lots of templates available. So you can just go through them. I am going to use this one. If you've not subscribed to my channel, please do so. I drop Canva tutorials every Wednesday. So please subscribe to my channel so you can get lots of updates when I drop a tutorial. So we're going to work with this. I am going to edit it to suit my taste. I want to delete this background and I want to delete this background also. I want this background color to be black. So let's see. Okay, this looks good as black. I will first change the text, all of this, to white so that when I change the background color to black, it is still going to be visible. Okay, I want to leave it as yellow instead. Then all of the text, I'm going to change all of the text to white. This is because my background color is going to be black. So I'm changing the text to white, all of the text. Changing all of it to white. You can play around with this to suit your taste, which is what I'm trying to do. You can have this link up on your Instagram page or your Facebook bio or whatever. I'm going to still change this one to, to white. Changing this to, to white. Now I am going to change the background color, like I earlier said, to black. Okay, this is looking good. <clears throat> Excuse me. I want to add a frame. going to add a square frame. Remember, you can play around with this to suit your taste however you want it to be. So I'm just going to crop this to fit into it this way. Then I will delete this one. Okay. I want to add a line. So I'm just going to click L on my keyboard. I want to change the line color to yellow. My brand color are yellow, white, and black. So that is why I am using all of this. I want to increase the line weight to this. Then it is way instead. I want to move all of this forward, upward. Okay, I think this is great. Now I'm going to start editing. You can change the font or you can just work with what you have here. So I'm just going to put in my name, put in what I do. So content designer and social media manager. social media manager so just edit it to so i'm going to ungroup this yes so this is perfect remember alignment is key when you're trying to align always take note of this the red line that's showing so i want to move this forward upward rather then I made a mistake somewhere around here. I'm going to delete this. 
okay so this is it my name my what i do so i want this one to be about so about me i will now what i will do here is to leave a link so where i have a description about me while here for example i'm trying to put my course link in my bio so i am just going to rename this and say shop i'm just going to rename it and say canva for beginners course Then I am going to link it up here. I'm going to add the payments link. So it can be Paystack, Flutterway, whatever payment link you use. Then right here, I am going to say, so I'm going to put the payments link in the first one. Right here, I can say services. So you have, it's linked to where I have all of my services listed. So here again, I want to say, I have another course I'm trying to, you know, or one of my services I'm trying to promote. So I'll say one-on-one -on -one training, one-on-one -on -one training. So I'm going to add the payment link. This is where you add all of your links. I say collaborations. So I'm going to add my email link here. I'll say connect. Or better still, I can say, find me on YouTube. On YouTube. Then I am going to add my YouTube link here. So let's just use a random link. Let me just say youtube.com. So you see how it is. I'm going to ungroup this first. I'm going to do that again. YouTube.com. Then click apply. You can see. So this is it. Anytime you add a link for you to be for you to be sure it is successful, it usually has this, like it's usually underlined. So that's just the thing about it. Every of the link you add, that means every of this text will have an underline so let me fit it to the screen so you can see well the next thing now i'm going to do is to add a photo of myself that i want to make use of so i'm just going to click on this one drag it and drop it into this delete this one okay go to top top Bring it up a little bit. So this is how I want it. I just want a headshot. When I'm done, what you would do is to click publish as website. You should not use this presentation style if it is or just a one page. But if you are trying to create multiple pages, that's when you use presentation. So I'm going to click like it's, like you can see. I say it's multiple page with easy page strokes, scrolling single page with parallax effect. This is it. And you can see standard single page. So this is single page site with navigation bar. This says multiple. I'm not using this one. So I want to try out this one. I'm going to click on open website so you can see it. So this is it. So let us click on this link we used. You see it goes straight to YouTube. So this is perfect. What I want to now do is to shorten the link because this link is too much so i am also going to rename this so i'm just going to leave it as bio link so i am now going to shorten this link i'll just say ctrl c that's to copy it In my browser i'm going to open bitly so this site will help me shorten the link Going to scroll down right here. I am now going to paste the link here, then click on shorten. Now, this is it. I'm going to copy it. 
and open on that browser and paste so we can confirm it has been shortened. Okay, and this is it. You can now copy the shortened link and paste it, which is this one, this link here, the copied link, the shortened link from the bitly.com. You will now take it to wherever you want to put it, your Instagram page, your Facebook bio, wherever, your LinkedIn bio, your Twitter bio, wherever you want to put it. And this is it. Your own link in bio website right in Canva. I hope you found this useful. If you need more clarity, please leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more tutorials every Wednesday. Bye for now.